The University of Wisconsin Whitewater offers the only business analytics major in Wisconsin. Business analytics is the study of how to help a business with data. For example, let's say you're having trouble with your sales goals. Analytics can help you understand what's happening to your customers by looking at data like purchase history, inventory, and even social media postings so that you can create a strategy to solve your problem. Whether it's sales, marketing, supply chain, accounting, or human resources, anything you can collect data on, you can use analytics to help a business. Now, the reasons why a student chooses a university and their degree are as unique as the person themselves. So let's hear from some of our students about why they chose UW-Whitewater and our analytics program. So why I chose Whitewater to, I guess, go even though they didn't have this certain degree is I love the school. I love the campus. I came in, I had friends who came here and um, they, they absolutely loved it. And I just toured, lo fell in love with it. Um, just great school. It's a great community and I have not regretted my choice whatsoever. Um, so what kind of led me to Whitewater? was that I knew that they had a really good business program. I knew it was close enough to home where I could regularly visit and also far enough away that I felt like I wasn't in my hometown cell. So, uh, I knew that the tuition and the kind of town that is kind of located would mean that things would be cheaper, but it was also big enough where the campus was a nice size and the student population and uh, professors would kind of give me the access to variety of resources so Hi, Nerd. i'm from jansen wisconsin and so the reason i chose uw whitewater was because it was closer to home i wanted to spend time with my family throughout my course my four years here and uw whitewater was able to provide that opportunity it also is a great business program and so i think that a lot of that has to do with the great professors that it has um, my experience with the professors here has been incredible. They are a great resource to students, and we build a very close one-to-one -one relationship with them. Um, they also are a great sense of mentors. I was a student here at UW-Whitewater through the Honors Program, and so I had to do um, projects and make courses, and so one of the ISCM department professors was able to help me with that project and stepped up to be a good mentor for me. And so I really appreciated that as a personal individual, as well as a college student, to have that additional opportunity. I love finding kind of the infrastructure and the data science behind it where you have this raw data and it tells a story. A lot of people just see a lot of numbers, it's boring to them, which is fine because that's why they pay us to do it. But it's so interesting because all those numbers, whether it be five rows of data or 26,000 records of data, it tells a story of whatever you want. So you can find a solution to everything you need through these numbers, whether it be marketing, sales, um, just regular C-suite supply chain, it's all run on data, which I find super interesting. Uh, I chose to get in data science and analytics because of the versatility of the degree and the abundance of opportunities. Uh, there are a lot of different applications of data science, and it's a great time to get into data science because data science is high in demand and low in supply, meaning there are a lot more job opportunities than people to fill them right now. Uh, choosing a business analytics degree uh, or data analytics emphasis at Whitewater helped me personally because everything we did in class, like all the examples and projects, directly applied to what I did in my internship. And this led me to feeling more prepared compared to other interns, and I eventually received similar positive feedback from my employer. Um, analytics is just, it just goes hand in hand with my major of supply chain management and Personally, the reason why I chose analytics was because I Googled what a good miner was with supply chain management. And long and behold, I looked into it a little more and it just sounded so interesting because in reality, anywhere you go in the business world, you're gonna have to know how to analyze numbers and what those numbers mean. Um, I think um, I chose to be a business analytics major too, also because of my experience um, in my summer internship uh, with a public accounting firm, you know, the importance of being able to actually understand and interpret large data um, was going to help me a lot in my career. 
also being able to you know have someone understand that with you and be able to explain the real message uh, can also help me with my day-to-day -day task and, and so uh, as of now i do have like a uh, audit associate position that i'll be going into after i graduate so i'm super excited about that and i think a really big part of me getting the job offer was my uh internship with the sustainability office as a data analytics intern this semester and also just my double major with business analytics kind of showed off that I was interested in being the next level of accountants that would understand data on a deeper level. And I think they're pretty impressed with, you know, my passion and kind of learning how to work with technology and kind of be integrated with it. So I think that's a really big part of, especially incoming professionals really should know how to uh, use platforms and different types of data to kind of utilize their you know, skills to um, upskill themselves. So I think definitely for any students currently, I think learning as much as you can about data or data science or even any platforms, just entry level platforms and just kind of building yourself up from there, is definitely gonna help you stand out. And I think that's something that you know everyone should do, whether or not they be entirely interested in data science or not, or maybe they're sort of like me where they kind of have a main focus in a different major, but might want to include data science into, you know, part of their tool bag of resources. I think it really helps to understand um, that portion of um, technology currently, especially going into the field. And, and we have data, raw data from whether it be Salesforce, um, just random data polls. We have uh, our ERP system that I go into and I link it to Access, Microsoft Access do some macros with that and make my own database for the 4C analysis, which is just knowing where the money is flowing to, whether it be to our personas, to just different customers, through businesses, through our channels, that's what the goal was. So I make it in this database, export my queries to Excel, have Excel macros to format it so our data visualization tool can read it very effectively and efficiently, and then I make dashboards, and right now they're being used in every think every aspect of the company right now, which is really exciting. I didn't even know until one day when the presentation and the CEO is like, yep, Matt made this uh, really cool dashboard. So I've worked directly with the CEO. I've worked directly with the CIO, COO, CFO, just not the CPO basically. So I'm kind of relied on by the C-suite, marketing, sales, uh, operations now. So it's su super, super exciting. I, I love my job and I love that it's, I just got right into it and they just let me go. There's people who just come to me and say, hey, do you know how to do this? And they're like super high up, senior, senior VP, senior exec. And like, oh yeah, no, we have this data analysis kit in marketing for, for the Primex brand. Just schedule a meeting with him and he'll walk you through it. And they bring me on these client calls that are, you know, they're trying to spend millions or hundreds of thousands of dollars probably. It's sometimes reaching to the millions. And they're like, okay, Matt, what do you think about this? We kind of need your approval. I'm like, I'm 20 years old. I'm not even graduated. I'm actually a junior, not even a senior. And they're relying on me for all this information. So it's, it's, it's really cool. Some of the best career opportunities are in business analytics, which is backed by dozens of government sources like the Bureau of Economic Analysis, the U.S. Census Bureau, and the Bureau of Labor Statistics. A recent consultant report found that there's an above average market for our majors and that there's many more job postings regionally for analytics positions than for all other occupations. So what can a high school student do now? Well, taking a class in data science, statistics, or programming is a start to developing the skills you'll need to succeed and thrive in a career in analytics. You can also do your own research and ask others about career opportunities in analytics and about which schools offer these majors like the University of Wisconsin-Whitewater.